Assalamu alaikum listeners, welcome to Inspire FM. We are here at Chonli High School for Girls today. A lovely day here today, celebrating Culture Day. And we're very fortunate to speak to uh, Lady Mayor here today. Madam Mayor May, of course, I get this right because last time I got it wrong, uh, of course, uh, this afternoon. And she's been waiting around to speak to us. So thank you so much uh, for your patience. Uh, and today you've come here to uh, Chonli High School for Girls regarding Culture Day. What exactly is Culture Day and what's actually happening at uh, Chonli High School for Girls today? So first and foremost, I want to thank everyone at Chorney Girls for inviting me here today to be a part of the Culture Day. So the Culture Day, this is the first time they've actually done it, and it is to celebrate everyone from their big, different backgrounds and cultures to get together. Um, for example, dressing up in their cultural clothes. There was a segment around cultural food. It's just integrating the communities and giving everyone an idea of their backgrounds and what it is and what countries they represent. Excellent. And why do you think it's so important for schools to do things like this? I think it's really important for schools to um, do cultural days so people can integrate and they are aware of other people's, people's cultures and the way things work. And I think it's a great opportunity for everyone to have discussions around each other's cultures, the sort of things that they all do individually and yeah, the sort of like um, themes and all that sort of stuff that they follow. Definitely. And of course, Luton being a diverse town, uh, I think it's lovely to see uh, so many, of course, the children here celebrating their own cultures and of course, their own identity, which is sometimes missed, of course, when you have uniforms on and everybody uh, is dressed the same. So I think, I it, think it, you're right. It is lovely. Yeah, it's, I think it's more around recognising that we are all different, but respecting one another and then out of that respect, we integrate because Luton is a multi multicultural community and it is very diverse. So I think it's important that we incorporate that in and especially at schools because at school it's where you learn a lot of things Most to definitely. start and begin with. And also, of course, uh, yourself being an ex-Chorley High School for Girl, I found out today. So how does it feel like coming back to your old school? It's so nice to come back to the school that I came to. So I actually... Um, used to go to the old building, but I've been on a tour around the new building today and I must say it's really impressive. They've really catered towards modern technology of these days. They've thought every little thing has got sort of detail in it. For example, there's a vending machine that they've got here and it'll have a book in it and students, once they're awarded, they get a token and they use that for the vending machine to sort of select a prize that they have. But Obviously, this, this is where I started my journey. And to think that I started my journey at this school and I've progressed the way I did, school played a massive part because it was the platform that I started with. It's been really, really nice to come back. And it's been nice because I can relate to the girls that are here and they can relate to me. For example, I've come now and they've seen what I've achieved and I'm a Chorn Eagle and anything possible. Excellent. Of course, of course, mashallah. Work hard and I'm sure you will get there. And just finally, what has been your favourite part of the day today? My favourite part of today really has been the fact that we had an interactive question and answer time and we really got into the nitty gritty of asking questions and they asked about like why I ended up going into politics and what my aspirations were and how I came about it and generally asked about my school life and what I went into, took an interest in my actual full-time job as well. And it was just, it was nice to interact with the girls and it was nice to hear from them. And sort of, and at the end of the session, we had about 10, 15 minutes where we could all sort of network and mingle. And it was nice to hear from them. And there were a few others that had a few more questions, but yeah, it's been, it's been really nice. Excellent. Thank you so much for your time and hope you enjoyed the rest of the day. Thank you.